this is a very unique situation for all of us. We're, we're going to coach our butts off until the end of the year, and then it's going to be 100% in somebody else's court. You know, they're going to make a decision on, on what they want to do from a general manager standpoint, and then that's the pecking order is the general manager gets to hire whatever he wants to do. And so we're just coaching to the end of the year and trying to get every ounce we can out of it and stay in the fight here. I love the way the team's playing right now, and I think I feel they're like the players do. We don't want the season to end. We're playing well, and we don't want it to end. You, heard, you do still have that advisory thing that travels with you. That yeah, it seems it seems to go with that forever. So, so you can, even if you're not the coach, you'll still be working for the others. Well, the, I, I want to help here, and so it, again, but it's up to the general manager. It's up to whatever they decide. I mean, if they want whatever they want, they're going to have to make that decision. So it's kind of in someone else's hands. Our whole Everybody's coaching career is in someone else's hands, and and uh, we'll find out uh, after uh, Bob hires the general manager. But are you comfortable with that? That it could be until look, June, all I, I, yeah, I I don't care. I don't care. I I just want to help the Oilers. You know, I I came here for the right reasons, and the more I stay here, the more I feel like all I want to do is help the team. So whatever they want me to do, uh, if I can help the team, that's what I want to do.